Okay, this video shows how you can have easy access to sales history so that you can reverse something or view something that you've just done for the day. So I'm going to open up uh, POS and we will double click it when we open it. That way it opens up in its own screen. So double click. So now it opens up in a window I can move around. So I'm going to put it right about there. Then I'm going to, I created a, a uh, sales history view called POS view which gives me the fields that I want to see. So I double click that one, it opens up in a window. Then I just have to close my main window and now I got POS and I've got the sales history right here. So this shows I've got a filter set automatically for anything that happened today. If I did want to look at other, something else, I can always change that filter, look at something from yesterday. But if I now go and sell something to a customer here, so I'll just sell an item. So right now it's cash sale. I'll uh, hit the F3 key and switch to a non-cash sale customer. Let's find somebody else. Say it sell it to this person here. So now I'm going to invoice it. So I'm going to press my F5 key, pay it by MasterCard, enter, enter. I don't have a receipt set up, so there it goes there. Now it's back to selling. Now let's say that person wanted to return that item or made a mistake on it or something like that, and all I need to do is click the refresh here. The last sale shows up automatically on, on the uh, screen here. And if I sort that by invoice number, it'll be at the bottom. Double click it. I see it here. I can reverse it by hitting credit and clicking on invoice and make it on MasterCard again. I can just hit M. Invoice it. Print off an invoice for it close the screen there and if I refresh this again you will see that the newest one is there. Now this is showing all sales and if I want to just limit it to my own sales I can add an additional filter where it says that uh, the salesperson is me so that way it's only showing my own stuff that shows up. That way I'm not seeing everybody's but that if you see them all you can always reverse something from any of the tills. So that's it.